It's time now for Local Ace 10 Local Sports. In sports, the NFL has six job openings, including both the Atlanta Falcons and the Jacksonville Jaguars. Jaguars fired head coach Doug Marone after four years on Monday. The Falcons, the Jaguars, the Lions, the Texans, the Jets, and the L.A. Chargers all searching for their next head coach. Jacksonville already in discussions with former Florida and Ohio State college coach Urban Meyer, who says he wants $12 million a year to coach the NFL team. Kansas City Chiefs assistant coach Eric Bieniemy also on a lot of teams' radar. Six openings, all six teams search for the next head coach. Again, Jaguars owner Rashad Khan said yesterday he wants to be more active in the day-to-day operations and personnel. That might have several applicants looking elsewhere. But again, apparently Jacksonville, the only team that appears to have their next head coach on the radar, as reports are that Urban Meyer and owner Khan have had several meetings looking to finalize the deal this week. Six NFL games Saturday and Sunday, then Monday night the College Football National Championship featuring Alabama and Ohio State down in Miami at Hard Rock Stadium. Tonight's the Heisman Trophy presentation. Goes to the best college football player of the year, three quarterbacks and a wide receiver. The four finalists, the award expected to go to wide at Devontae Smith of Alabama, already named AP Player of the Year. If he wins, he'll be the first wide receiver since Desmond Howard to win the award. That occurred back in 1991. Of the three finalists are all quarterbacks, Alabama quarterback Mac Jones, Gators quarterback Kyle Trask, and Clemson's quarterback Trevor Lawrence. It will be a virtual event tonight, televised on ESPN at 7 p.m. Three NFL games Saturday are as follows. It all begins at 1 p.m. Saturday with Indianapolis Colts at Phillip and Phillip Rivers going into Buffalo, where Josh Allen has had an MVP-type season, and the Bills look like the hottest team heading into the playoff picture this year. Game 2 at 4.30 Saturday, the L.A. Rams at Seattle. And Game 3 Saturday night at 8.15, the Washington Redskins at Tampa Bay Buccaneers as Tom Brady has guided the Buccaneers into the playoffs for the first time in a long time. Then on Sunday, three more games also beginning around 1 p.m. Good matchup between the Baltimore Ravens at the Tennessee Titans. 4.30 is the Chicago Bears at New Orleans Saints. And then Sunday night, the Cleveland Browns at Pittsburgh Steelers. Both Kansas City and Green Bay have the first-round buys this year as an expanded field of playoff teams only the top seed in each conference getting the weekend off. Super Bowl was set for Tampa Bay first Sunday in February. The high school basketball teams will be back in action this weekend on the road, both Friday and Saturday. Friday, the region season begins as the Jackets head to Douglas to take on Coffee County. Then on Saturday, a rematch of the Glen Academy games, which were played here last Saturday, this time down at Glen. Glen Academy won both those games here Saturday, 44-42 overtime win in the girls' game. Boys game, a close game as well. Glen Academy won it by a final of 66-62 in the rematch Saturday down at Glen Academy. Finally, in sports, the Cross Country Booster Club is asking for your help. They're hosting their 15th annual and final Yellow Jacket 5K run and walk and one-mile buzz on February 27th. Registration can be found on the Cross Country team's website. Again, you can also call the following number, 912-256-2381 for more information. Again, they're, state they're collecting sponsorships for the event. Again, $50 to $99 company name will be listed on the back of the T-shirt as a bronze sponsor. These shirts are given to all participants in the race. $100 to $249, your company will be listed on the back of the T-shirts and a silver sponsor. $250 to $499, your company will be listed on the back of the T-shirts as a gold sponsor. And $500, not your company, will be listed on the back of the T-shirt as a platinum sponsor. Every $100 that you contribute, they'll send you two applications with a free entry for you or your employees, which includes a free T-shirt for the race. Again, it all takes place on February 27th. They state this will be the 15th annual and final Yellow Jacket 5K run and walk. Again, if you need more information, contact the following number, 912-256-2381. That's going to do it for the latest in the local sports. sports.